Why did Walter kill Mike? That is one of the big questions of the Breaking Bad series. In this video, I will give you my vision of why Walter did this. If you for some reason haven't seen this show, there will be a spoiler alert, so beware. First of all, we've seen that Walter does some of the same things his enemies do. For example, when Gus Fring had to throw up, he put a towel down on the floor for his knees. Walter didn't know this, in fact he wasn't even around. Gus was in Mexico when he did this. However, Walter does the very same thing. Now at this point where he shoots Mike, Jesse is completely out of the business. The guy Walter is cooking with is Todd. Todd is the very reason why Jesse is out of the business. He shot an innocent child out of nowhere. We need to keep in mind that at the moment where Walter shoots Mike, Todd has been under Walter's wing for quite some time now. Also it didn't really look like Walter had any problem with Todd shooting that kid. When Mike doesn't want to give the names to Walter, I think that from being too much around Todd, he shoots Mike out of nowhere. Just like Todd did with that little kid. We also see that Walter breaks out of this immediately, regretting what he's done. Now, the only other character who would probably do this in Walter's situation is in fact Todd, and I think that is where Walter gets this from. In other words, it feels like Walter is snapping into the monster that Todd really is, and when he shoots Michael, he just snaps out again, regretting it instantly. Assuming he is in fact taking things from his enemies, even though Todd isn't an enemy at this point of the show, he is still the guy he is running his empire with. I'm planning on making a video explaining Todd in the future, because I think he is one of the most underrated characters and needs a good explanation. I think he is the most hated character in the Breaking Bad show. So if you're interested in that, please stick around, the video will come out soon. Thanks for watching.